WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento with the mid-afternoon update. Uh, as Basil would say, we've got a bifurcated market. We got the Dow Jones down just a little bit. We got the Russell down just a little bit. The S&P is up about 17, 18 points, making new highs as we speak. And the informidable NASDAQ is up another 120 as they're getting ready to promote uh, the earnings of, uh, I guess, some of these other companies that uh, we've got going on here. So we'll see what uh, see what happens with uh, some of these things as they're uh, moving along uh, each day here. So let's take another look at one thing that I want to mention to you. Those of you that are involved in eating meat, you better be prepared, folks, because we've had a breakout into new high ground into cattle. I mean, they are prices that we haven't seen in nine years. They keep going straight up. The demand for beef is great, telling us that there's not much of a recession out there as we look at it, but that's what we're looking at. The main thing that is in the news today, without the slightest doubt, I'm going to post this chart that I did real early this morning, and we're sharply higher from where I expected it to go. Nothing new there, but uh, we were looking for about 183 uh, as a price in an Apple. Uh, it's trading at 184 and change right now so that's the main thing they're talking about virtual reality and uh, all the other things that the apple people have i will have a, uh, if those of you that read the trade what you see a newsletter one of the greatest things i ever read was this weekend when john was writing that uh, back in the early 70s someone had a chance to buy one third of the stock of apple one third of the stock of apple for $50,000, and he passed on it. He thought it was too expensive, and that would be worth well over uh, almost a trillion dollars for that $50,000 investment, almost like if you subscribe to trade what you see. Are you kidding me? $50,000 to $1 trillion? Shut the front door and raise the rent. We're going to be talking about some things in the foreign currency markets, the stock market, and also gold. So stay with us. We'll be right back, and uh, we'll pay a few bills here, and then we will uh, talk about some of the other things that we uh, like to talk about each day here. Yeah. 